you want to know? Well, I think I know about you. And I bless everyone and welcome back to my channel. So, yes, you can see I've got my straw hat on. <laughs> it's really hot today. But I promised you that I would do the um, video showing you how I plant my stuff out. So, I thought I would have come back on like Tuesday or so. But I had updated um, the, the progress of the germination, the seeds. And I had a peak again yesterday because I couldn't resist. That was the 23rd and boy were they sprouting also the corns i've got a surprise to show you as well it only took three days i can't believe this so anyways we're gonna look in here so we've got the beet the chicory and the um, french beans all right so let me just open this for you look at this guys i've got french beans growing hey honey yeah you want some more crisps Okay, go and ask Destiny to give you a crisp and she'll give you a crisp, okay? Right. Tell her to give you the P1. The P crisp, yeah? Yeah, good boy. So I've got the French beans. I've got the chicory here growing. You can see that little one growing there. And then I've got the beet leaves. Look at the colors already. I'm so excited. And this is where we're gonna plant some of the stuff out. I'm gonna leave the um, the beets to let them go on, you know, germinate a bit more. The chicory as well, I think. I've got a few. No, it's just one coming out at the moment. I'm gonna leave that for now. But the French beans, I'm gonna plant the French beans in the tires. And the tires. Them two tires over there. Sorry, I got distracted. So the French beans is going to go in the two tires and then the corns going to go behind me. So let me just show you what I'm doing, okay? So do you remember I had some vegetable peels in these two tires? I was going to plant some uh, melons in here, but then I don't have the space for it to run properly. So what I'm going to do is if I plant the French beans, then I can have them growing up. So it kind of give here a nice green and it will have the nice flowers and it's going to be next to the red currant and black currants and strawberries and so everything's gonna pollinate if you know what I mean so I'm gonna put it right here and let everything just grow together as one happy bunch all right so I don't have a um, I can't find my tripod I said I hold it and show you what I'm doing so basically I'm gonna pop these in here so, so just bear with me all right so there we go so I've got this little tool sorry my hand got in the way I've got this little tool is to weed out the you know the weeds from the grass but I just have it turning around and then I'm gonna plant a couple just around the rim I like five so I'm gonna do five so one two three four five okay I'm gonna do five in here so how much how much hold on I think I plant seven French beans this week. I'm gonna put three in here so three in here so and then I'm gonna put one somewhere else because I like odd numbers so sorry let's go again so I'm gonna do three yeah because I only plant seven but it's like odd numbers three five seven nine I do like six though six hours get me confused with nine the story of that I got whooped at school for my six and my nines because um, I had this teacher and she was a maths teacher and the woman was so i think she was an alien god no because she was just she just did evil she just did love to beat people and she kept me saying me three times table and i had a problem with three with six and nine and me mixed up against the three three just a, a six or something i mixed them two up man i know me still remember the whooping it traumatized me so much and math used to be my favorite subject and now I can't be bothered with Max. So I'm just gonna cover these up and just label here for my piece. So yeah, that was a traumatic experience because of the the numbers in it. So six and nine still are my favorite number, but I mostly like nines and um you know threes and fives and sevens. Alright, make a girl on here so now and do the same. 
for this one. So I've got my little container there, so it's like a big one hole here, so I want here, so I don't even know if she's still a teach because she was a wicked little woman. Miss Danelson. I can call out your name. Miss Danelson, you did wicked to me. You used to beat the hell out of me. And me never like you. God forgive you though. Because you never know what you do to me. Right. Oh, actually, I did plant. A nine. Me did actually plant because it's three more there. So it can work. I can plant three. Oh, that is so cool. You see? The universe working with me. Threes. Right, so we plant some French beans in these two. All right, so just give me a moment. Let me locate where I'm gonna plant. Oh, you know what? I can plant it in the back there, right there, sir. So I can plant the tree them there, so and it can actually run with this as well. I can tie a string up, up somewhere up, and make it run. Just give me a minute. Right, so I'm gonna plant them in here, sir. So that's one, two and three to be honest been not sure how close french beans for plant so this is just our trial and error so i've got this one i'm gonna just pop him in there so and this one I'm popping in there, so. this one never really burst so good yet so we're gonna see if it's gonna come to none and then we just cover them up so we've got french bean and then i'm gonna come with my tag and tag them and then we just have the the beets and the chicory left for plant out of this container and this is from the 21st yeah from the 21st yeah so it's a continuation of the other video i did right so let's see around here so now let me show you my little container when we have all of my little things i'm in there so i have my labels over here so and i've got my slug tape and I've got my seeds and everything and I've got my cats intruding. So yeah, let me come back to you when I organize everything. But I'm gonna write on my labels and the date and everything. All right, see you in a minute. Right, this is where we are now. So over here, so I have the part where I wanna use for the corn part. But I had put the bird feeding up here, sir. And look, my said and my girl. The whole of them are growing there, you see it? <laughs> so, I'm just gonna plant the condom because the condom are much bigger anyway. So, I'm not gonna worry about the bird feed. I'm gonna plant my corn. So, let me show you know, what happened over one night. So, this is the sweet corn called Lark, F1 Lark. So, look here, people. You know, see roots? Up here, roots, you know? right and then over here so we have the golden eagle look there our pear roots right so we're gonna plant them out now quickly we're gonna plant them out and we're gonna go around at the front and do some other work all right so me come back when me plant them out because me not have the amends for sure no how me a plant but i hear some me a plant them so they look good so you can't see when they grow in the summer i'm gonna dress back yeah so over the corner yeah, them are good there. see you in a minute right so let's have a look they're in their little beds now and they're gonna go to bed and you'll see them in the days to come okay so let's cover them up when i was growing up my dad used to plant corns and they used to be so big we used to play hide and seek in them so me doing this right now is a joy to my soul because it reminds me of papi you remind me of my daddy my hero okay over oh, yeah so i'm gonna leave here so, so these are the corn bed and we all know what over here so then i'll come back and water it all right and then i'm gonna find other locations for the other ones like over here so i can put some here right here so here so and over there so probably up here so as well yeah and probably over there so so we'll find some space yeah 
but this is what I'm doing today I'm planting out the corns all right so if you don't see me after this you'll see the progression of everything and then let me just have a look to see if anything in here so it's coming because all right look at the date the date is the 18th yeah and this is um my buy this to see if anything will come nothing nothing is coming and it's of 10 pound my pay for nothing is coming and i brought these inside and just three days and them just pop in so if you can find recyclable stuff to do it in do it guys and not spend the big money you hear because this is not doing one thing all right it's in a bit right we're back so i'm gonna do this quickly i'm gonna show you how i plant the golden eagle quickly 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 all right pop this in here so and then look at this wow these ones are so pretty i think these ones are the 22 am um, centimeter corns so i'm gonna plant some at the front as well wow they're so pretty okay so i'm just popping them on the ground and then i'm gonna insert them okay so these two at the back was f1 lark them two at the back but these at the front are gonna be golden eagle and i'll come back all right bless everyone and I haven't been recording because I've been so busy doing the front of the garden I have done a raised bed at the front of the garden which is 10 by six and a half and I decided that I'm gonna plant our pure vegetables at the front of the garden so we've got some zucchinis here we've got some color here trying to come up we've got pumpkin we've got bro Brussels sprout sorry We've got broccoli, broccoli and cauliflower and we've got some corn at the back and we have some peas coming. So, and the watermelon and watermelon. So yeah, this is not a Okay, so this is the update video of my um, germination in the ice cream tub and these are two beet leaf that I germinated and they are growing so this is a success although I've lost so much beetroot I've planted them out here and let's see how long they're gonna take to pop up but these are the two I germinated and they're growing so well let me show you another the corn right and these are the corns that I've germinated in the tub here they are planted out at the front they were in the little 